Hello everybody and welcome to another Minecraft video. This video I want to start a new project. And well, you probably read the title. It's with villagers. It's going to be a huge huge project. But first, but before I tell you also, please subscribe, because every subscriber helps a lot, and it's free. You can always change your mind, and I, ju it ju I just really appreciate it. So, yeah. Now, I will go tell you what I'm doing. So, it's going to be a big villager project, and the project is, I want to get one villager for every single trade I have. Every single enchantment book, and like, every minor every single trade in every level of every type of villager Ugh. it's gonna be a hard it's gonna be a long and hard process but hopefully i get it and that was a missed mlg what the heck i don't do that <laughs> so yeah um, I'm going to do that new, a new big villager project of getting every single villager. We gotta land the MLG right there. So yeah, that's what you saw earlier, maybe in the bottom right of the screen if you saw it. Um, I'm, I need to set up a villager breeder first, that's what that was. And to set up a villager breeder, I'm, there's probably an automatic way you can, you can do it with only eight when with only three beds and just takes makes it so the villager that's born doesn't occupy a bed anymore and then and then like the two um what, people that are making the baby sees only them two in the room occupying the bed and then they have another baby complicated stuff like that so i i think i know what well, um I know what you do. I know, I know that it's possible to do, and I know how it would work. If you should, but I don't know how to do the redstone or anything. If you showed me, I wouldn't see how the redstone would work. But I know what it would have to do and why it worked. So, yeah. But I'm not good with redstone at all, so I'm just gonna use a bunch of beds. And the second part of it is the farm part where the villager, we have to have a farmer villager that picks up the food and then hands it to the other ones and then they breed. There's enough beds. So yeah, that's what you saw earlier. Over here, I made a little, a lot of, it was, it's like 18 beds and a lot of farm land around it over here. And that's going to be where we breed all our villagers. Because we ran out of villagers in the other village. And I think I actually fa have found four villagers in this seed. Despite only fa find eight. In this seed, I found like four villages within the thousand blocks. And then last seed, I found one village traveling over 5,000 blocks. Man, these seeds are very unpredictable, and I just ruined that. So yeah, I have a little farm going here that the farmer villager would farm. So yeah, now I will, I need to get some villagers over here. How to do that? Um, let's see. And the reason I didn't put it, like, right here is because I really want to see this part of the house. Because it's, it's by far the best thing I've ever made, that side of the house. The other side, the other sides, they're still really good for my building. But, like, that side's amazing. So, yeah, that's why I don't want to cover it. Because I love this side. It's just so amazing. Don't you agree? Oh, man. At least for one of my builds. This side's... Well, they're still really good for one of my builds. This is probably the worst side or two sides. Uh, this side, I didn't change anything that much. 
Yeah, I, I, I'm giving you a tour of the house again. Uh, I just love my house. I don't know if you can tell. You probably couldn't. Okay, come on. Really? I can't smash this? Why? That's... Mm. <sighs> the shovel actually is almost out of durability. But yeah, I need to build around this. So I'll show you, I'll show you, I might show you in a time lapse or detail it with you, but I'll see you when I do the basic structure. Because this is going to be, it's definitely not going to be as big as this, but it's going to be semi, semi-large. Okay guys, I'm doing a bunch of work, cut down a bunch of trees, bred a bunch of cows and sheep. And, well, I'm a villager breeder, this is what I've gone. Um... Well, I have uh, all these carrots where I keep expanding and of course the farmland and I've built these little things that I'm going to I'm going to make like these little things because they don't look supported a little more supported but other than that the structure is looking great and yeah that this is what the villager breeder is gonna look like so I hope you have a picture of your mind I'm hoping to put like a little dome kind of shape or something up there maybe remove these two logs but without symmetry I don't like anything like you can't have something without symmetry and that's a fact so yeah I'm gonna keep working on this and I'll show you when I get to the fun part of adding the details oops Okay guys, I am caught in the crossfire of many mobs at night. The creeper's right there. I'm scared that I will not survive. Probably okay. okay. I was scared for a second that I wouldn't I wouldn't survive. <sighs> I got down to low health there. <sighs> okay. Sorry. Just in case I died, I wanted to show you the battle. Oh. Jockey. There we go. Okay. Well, yeah. That's all I, that's all I came back for. To show you that scary moment. I'm actually shaking. I didn't actually get down to too low health. I didn't think I was going to die. Because I was really close to land there. And could have jumped out. Voided the creeper. So. I th I th and I thought I'd get shot like two more times. And I'd get to low health. But I wouldn't die I thought. But I'm still shaking. Because it was. It was, a, it was a kind of a near-death experience, not really, but it was, but it, if I didn't, if I, like, if I just played that out in the moment and I didn't actually have enough time to react, then I might have died. But let's go kill this creeper. I like two-shotting um, mobs. It's cool. Two-shot creepers. And just do that with a sword. Yeah, I think a sword is definitely better than an axe. Unless you're fighting against an actual player. Or where he where he uses a shield. Then an axe is better to disable their shield. But still then, you hit them with an axe and then you hit them with a sword. That'd be good. But actually, hitting them with an axe would probably be better in, even with out shields in hand-to-hand -hand combat bat, um, I'd say with other people so because um the people run away and your axe has enough time to recharge and then and um, there's no point of using your sword that does less damage but in this nothing really runs away skeleton does those maneuvers to avoid hits which is really annoying besides that nothing runs away ghasts i guess but 
it, there's no use, there's no shield person, there's no thing that runs away with no health or anything, so, shield are not needed, I can just go up close and hit them three, three or two times, well, a any, a spider two times, a creeper two times, skeleton two times, and a zombie two times, all those are two times, but I think there's definitely some mobs with higher health that you have to do three or four times. But yeah, I'm enjoying this. This is my progress so far. And, well, it doesn't look a ton good. That is not going to be there. Uh, that was just my scaffolding. And yeah, well, um, I was, I guess, close to a near-death experience. Okay. Let's go fight these villagers. No, oh, I keep going next to them. Let's go fight these guys. This guy's going to get shot to death. Shoot him to death! Come on, why is he not dead yet? Thank you. Now I can fight them. No shield needed. There we go. They wouldn't kill him for some reason. And, yeah. Well, that was cool. Whenever I fight those guys, I don't talk for some reason. It's probably because I'm scared. Whenever I've been hand-to-hand -hand combat, I can't do it while I comment it. Uh, I need to really get better at commentating and knowing that I'm and being aware that I'm not talking so that I talk again when I'm not. So sorry that I wasn't commentating there, but you gotta do what you gotta do. And I should put commentating over PvP, but here I am. We oh, that was that was an epic fail. <laughs> okay, now that was mm. now I'm addicted to water buckets again. No. Okay, I'm just I'm gonna stop. No more. Bad. <sighs> Oh, one more. Okay, that was not it. Wee. Yay. Okay, now no more. No more. At all. Okay, I'm gonna do a little progress update. Oh, gosh. Um, so, I've killed a bunch of cows and gotten a bunch of leather. And the sheep, I, I just keep shearing whenever they're ready. And, more importantly, I got the dome done on this. I'm not sure I like the design anymore. It's not looking that great. It's looking about average for one of my builds. And that is the best day. I know I've said this so many times, but it's just the best build I've ever made by far. So far. So, don't expect this to look good as, that, as good as that. Um, after details, hopefully it'll look okay. But there's a chance that it could just look terrible. That dome thing, I'm re th that's, that's what's done really bad to this build. And this build, it, before it was the roof. That's kind of the high point of it. I'm really bad at, like, the high points and stuff. And, like... Like, where the block placement, like, kind of, I need the symmetry. That's probably a big part of it. My need of symmetry ruins a lot of things. And yeah. So, I don't know. I really don't, I'm, I'm, the fan, I'm a big fan of everything else, but this 
Ugh, I don't like it. Every other part, it was looking great, so. And no. Just not good at, like, the roof part or something. But yeah, we're doing good. We filled out this care form, and it is actually very late. Um, it is day 126. Holy cow. We survived a lot in this episode. No, wait. Wait. Oh, this is episode 7, not episode 6, isn't it? Because episode 6 was a mining episode. I remember I did the 100 days on episode 5 and mining. So that means last episode only took up 8 days. And this episode has taken 18 now. Because at the beginning of this episode, I, 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 not like the complete beginning, but almost the beginning. I might have slept like once before that. So, well, the, yesterday's episode only took 7 or 8 days, but this one took more than 20. Well, so far it's took an 18 or 19, but I'm not only going to spend 1 or 2 more days on this. I'm going to spend a lot longer. And I'm not going to add all the details or anything. I'm just going to get the main, the big building done. Because I can't do a whole build in one episode. And I know that sounds like one build in one episode. Dude, uh, I see Minecraft YouTubers do it all the time. But do you see Minecraft YouTubers do it all the time and their builds have a lot of detail pretty big build, builds and they upload every day and they do it in one day I don't think so so yeah and I don't even I have school for most of my day so I can't even work on it it's too long so you know I can't do a whole, a whole build in one episode um, doing this main structure is going to be a big stretch, and I might even not do it this, be able to do it this episode, but, um, I've already recorded, when I recorded episode six, um, I, rec I already recorded episode five, wait, is this episode six? I don't know if this is episode six, in episode five, I think, yeah, we did mine in episode 5. So it is episode 6. Okay. Unless I'm completely wrong. Now I'm going to go get an MLG bucket, and I'll see you um, in a while for me, but only a few seconds for you. So, yeah. See you. Okay. Well, this is it from the front. And I know it's bland because there's no details, and we'll add, we'll be adding that another episode. And I don't like the slab thing a lot, but other than that, thing looks pretty good. Kind of resembles an ocean monument, but no other side is done, as you can see. And it is it is day uh let's see where's okay it's day one hundred thirty three. And, well, it's day 133. And that means I've spent 33 days on this episode. A lot of time, basically. So, yeah. I've spent a lot of time on this episode. Be because I had enough time to spend a lot of time. But usually I won't be able to spend this much time. And, yeah, that's it from there. But, of course, we haven't added anything to the other sides. Big project. We might not finish it in this episode. But, I'm excited. Move the villagers in. Well, I'm not excited to move the villagers in. I always hate moving villagers. It actually sucks. So, correction. I'm not excited to move the villagers. But, we're going to do it anyway. So, yeah. This is how it looks so far. And, well, I'm going to keep going. Okay, this side definitely not as good. 
but I still like it a little bit. Um, I think I, I, I put windows, it looked terrible. Put trapdoors, it still doesn't look that good, but it looks okay. Um, so yeah. That's that side done, and I think that's all of this building we're going to do this episode, because it is truly, really hard to, um, it will be really hard to finish this all in one episode, so we'll finish it next episode. And, yeah. This is not the end of the episode, because I have not recorded that much. It's only been, like, 20 minutes, so... For the next 10 minutes of the episode, what should we do? Um, we won't land MLG buckets for the next 20 minutes. Let's go harvest our farm. It's kind of satisfying. And we'll put this in our offhand, hopefully replant. Nah. Wait, what? Yeah, I think we're just gonna ruin it all. All these carrots are gone. That's truly satisfying. And they're all gone. And our inventory is, of course, full. Uh, the, I, I, I really like making these episodes. It's really fun. But it's also really hard. Now, what was that monster nearby? Who is it? Ah, uh, we'll never know. I'm going to go do this. Make a chest. Put some stuff in it. Mainly my carrots. Actually, just my carrots. And then we'll go get some more carrots. Well, hopefully this project turns out looking good. Um, the, th this side is so far my favorite, and it doesn't. It's definitely. I don't. I don't think anything is gonna look as good as that house ever in my in my, in ever in my building. <sighs> but yeah, I don't like that this side as much, but it's fine. Now, um, yeah, I think that is go. Well, no, it's not gonna be it. This is only a 20 minute episode. Well, I guess I might end it here because, well, I've spent so much time on this episode. Okay, so, yeah, um, we're gonna episode end the episode here. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and. Goodbye.